Joining me today are ZCC Cutting Tools, and we're going to be talking about some of their products that may look familiar, but they come with a new twist, don't they, Dave? Tell us more yeah. about these, uh, these new face mills. Yeah, so these systems are, are, are sort of next in, next generation redevelopment. Um, we've looked at the design of our portfolio. So for the introduction of our new 2023 catalog, we bring a new product to the market. So uh, uh, advanced sort of um, design on a on a previous slant. So pick any. So that single sided, the, the 45, I think, yeah. one we all know. What, what... Yeah, so we've redesigned this body. As I said, it's an old generation product, uh, single sided. Um, positive inserts are coming more back in the fashion. We didn't just want to reintroduce the inserts. We brought new grade and geometries for the for the inserts for the next generation. But we also changed the body, so we're taking weight out of the body. We're making these chip uh, spaces larger, so we can get the evacuation of the swarf, which gives us better accessibility for the coolant supply. But also then looking at our angle of our you know, where we're screwing it in, so we're pushing the inserts deeper in, you know, tighter into the pocket. To give us um, um, more rigidity, more, rigid, more, more rigidity on the inserts. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, and in terms of the button mill, we can't forget the button mill. People talk about high feed milling and various other yeah. strategies, but still one of the best cutters on the marketplace. Yeah, again, very popular for us. We've had a, a long history in button mill technology. Um, pre, probably with this product, we the, the, what was um, lacking with us was the lack of indexes on on the seat end. We we had a, a sort of um, uh, rotational system so this now is uh, again we modified the body with these new technology new, new techniques with the re weight removal but also now an index in facet on the on the insert so you get a mm -hmm. better location for the for the um, for the insert seats and a lot of manufacturers love single-sided positive yeah. make, arguably kinder for the machine so kinder yeah. for the material but equally there's manufacturers out there that want cost per reg and it's, yeah. it's here in abundance looking at that tool exactly yeah there's like um you know, this this is a, uh, a sort of redesign. We had a size eight and a size six. Um, a size eight was a five mil depth of cut, but because it's, du it's, it's double sided negative, um, you're, you're slowing things down. So we redesigned it. We have a three a three D geometry um, insert, so it's giving us a positive and a negative. We got this wider chip space again. We got now a, a, a 0.5 mil increase in depth of cut to allow us to dry faster. And again, all the all the other advantages of a bigger chip space, better coolant supply, and um, and a stronger location for the on the screw. And finally, this is part of uh, quite a new range, isn't it? Obviously, yeah. uh, square insert. This fits a number of holders, but this one that's seventy two. I'm guessing. Uh, yeah, seventy five. Seventy five. Yeah. So why would somebody use a seventy five against a forty five or, or a ninety? Um, obviously, obviously, um, forty five is is a stable, you know, stable. Mm -hmm. But on some applications, especially when you want to sort of feed a little bit, a uh, bit more aggressively, seventy five degree progen favors over forty five. Obviously, when eighty eight is, uh, we don't do, do ninety with the system. We go eighty eight. The, the so we are not a, a double negative mm -hmm. square yeah. in the ninety orientation. But obviously, then you've got to slow things down considerably because it's. It's that, you know, the way you sit in the material, but 75 will give you that nice smooth cut, faster feed rates. Um, it's, it's good for roughing up material. 100%. And I know this, this insert fits various other cutters as well. So for people watching that do a lot of milling, it's worth considering. But how do people find out more about the 2023 catalogue, these products in particular? How do they reach out? How do they find out more? So the 2023 is now available. So you can contact me or any of my team for hard copies or digitally via our website at www.zcc.com. CT-Europe.com. Thanks a lot, Dave, and yeah. thank you at home for watching.